DJ Earth here on um, SCFC Fan TV. I'm here to preview the um, Cambridge v Sunderland game. Um, it's like I've been on local anaesthetic because I just feel completely numb about the club at the minute. Um, all I'm going to say is, is like, this has to be Lee Johnson's last chance. He's, he's That thick bit of rope is now a fray into a one single tiny piece of thread. You know, this this has to be his last chance because if we didn't beat Cambridge, that that that, that that's got to be it. I mean, if there's any Sunderland supporter out there that still thinks after the after the Cambridge match, if we if we lose or just draw, that you know we need to give Lee Johnson more time, then all I can say is you must be happy with just staying in this division and maybe he's gone in for the playoffs or something because there's there's, there's somewhat not right. There's somewhat not right. I mean, look, I know we can say Cambridge got a, a good draw against Wigan, but that's got now to do with this Kevin game coming up, has it? I just don't know what to say anymore, really, the way the way they've gone on. I mean, the last match against um, Shrewsbury, you know, they came out second half for 10 men, and it's as if they had more players on the pitch. And we play defensive. It's like, well, what, what, well, what can you do? What, what chance have you got if you're going to be digging that? Um, I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for a one-one draw. Again, against Cambridge because I just haven't got any confidence in the team, in the in the management at the moment. I just can't see where we're going to bang a load of goals. And have a great, great performance. And I say we've got injuries. Gooch is playing at the back and that. But I'm sick of making excuses for the team. You know, if if we couldn't put in a good performance second half against Shrewsbury. Down to ten men. Then when are you going to do it? As far as I'm concerned, you're just not, are you? Um, I keep saying Stewart's going to bag a goal. But he's just really struggling. Because the lack of service is just non-existent for him. So... Um, I'm gonna go for O nine again to, to to bag a goal because, like I say, Stewart's not, just not getting any service at all. Now we know people say like we're only five or six points away or off the top and that, but I didn't want to be saying ifs or buts. I want to be up there. I want to be saying you know we're five points clear at the top. Since we've been in this division, it's always been ifs or buts. <clears throat> oh, but we're only two points from getting into the playoffs, so we're only. You know, we're only nine points now from top. It's it's just not good enough. Do you know what I mean? We've been in this division four years. Um, in, when's it going to stop? You know, if, if we keep on playing shite and drawing and losing games, are we going to turn around um, in February and say, well, to be honest with you, we're not doing too bad with Lee Johnson because we're only, uh, we're only nine points from away from making the playoffs. It's like, how far are we willing to sink with our club? It's like, how, how, what do we want? Do we actually want us to get promoted? You know? As, what, what, what is the Sunderland fans actually wanting to do? You know, because I'm beginning to question what's uh, the owner's plans to do. Do you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm amazed Lee Johnson's still at the club, to be quite honest with you. Um, but as for, as for the match against Cambridge and stuff, it's... I just didn't know what to say anymore. It's like, it's... Gone out there and I'm saying put a performance in but if, if they kind of put a performance in second half like they did against um, Shrewsbury and to be fair they didn't play too bad first half you know what the hell has been said second half to make them come out and play like that against Shrewsbury um, so all I can say is we've just got to wait, wait and see what happens because I'm sick to death of saying you know we'll, we need to put in a good performance I'm going to let them do, do that, do you know what I mean? Okay, but just let's just see and just wait and see what happens. But I don't know if we're going to get a result, the three points, you know, he's, 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 he's got again, and we, we need to hear something from the owners. Uh, you know, and there's, there's a majority of fans now um, wanting <coughs> Lee, Lee Johnson out. I mean, when you looked at our crosses and final balls against Shrewsbury, especially second half, there were. We're absolutely shambolic. I mean, we had, we got a free kick in the last kick of the game. Um, the ball was just put straight straight out of play by Sun, and there wasn't even a decent cross into the box. It was just hit hard, too far, went behind the goal line, 
just absolutely pathetic and that was us over the whole of the second half it's just I just kind of see unless there's some drastic changes where we're going to go forward on this one I mean at the most you know you can possibly positively say you know I didn't get beat even though I see like we need to get a win and that's the only result we do and that, that's all I can do really so that's my end review for the Cambridge match I'm going to go for 1-1 and have a safe journey down there and let's see if we can bring us three points eh? fingers crossed